All right, everyone, come on and gather around. Let's have a seat. Now, as you all know, today is a very special day. And what day is that? Gift day! That's right. So all of your parents have already sent your gifts here for you to open. And right there under that tree is a bag for each of you. Are we ready? Yes! Go! I told her, you're fired. <laughs> <laughs> oh, hi. I'm so sorry we're late. We missed the bus and everything. And anyhow, here are the cookies you asked me to bring. That's what you brought. They look so cheap. And where did you even buy those anyway? Uh, well, I didn't buy them. I... My son and I, we baked them together. I baked and he decorated. First, you show up at my Christmas party late, and then you bring those. <laughs> well, it's a good thing I bought these. Each one is handmade by an award-winning pastry chef. That cost ten dollars. A cookie. Wow, those look delicious. It's a good thing I didn't care on Jasmine and had a backup plan. How do you know her again? Her son and my son are friends, so I had to invite her. All right, everyone, it's time for the white elephants. Let's start with number one. Oh, that's me. I'll take this one. Smart choice. That one's from me. A crystal ornament. Wow, thank you so much, Karen. Oh, <laughs> it's Swarovski. I know we said $25 limit, but come on, <laughs> who really followed that? <laughs> <laughs> ah, oh. I'm number two. I choose. Hmm. Oh, maybe choose another one? No, I already chose. Is this a handmade ornament? It looks like it costs less than a dollar. <laughs> <laughs> Let me guess. This one came from you. Yeah, my, my son and I, we painted it together. Uh, it reminded me of when- Where'd you get the materials? The 99 cent store? <laughs> <laughs> if you don't like it, you you could always 
that trade it for uh... No. I don't want anyone else to get stuck with this. Let's move on to number three. Fine. Oh, really? So awesome. <laughs> Here you go, Richie. I hope one of these has what I asked for. Well, I know you're going to love them. I'm gonna open them right now. <sighs> What's wrong, Max? Didn't your mother get you any gifts? Oh. Uh, well. Here you go. I hope you like it. <laughs> Thanks, Mom! <laughs> A picture frame? That's what you got him for Christmas? <sighs> How cheap. Um, I know it's not much, honey, but I hope you like it. Like it? I love it! <laughs> Thanks, Mom. I'll put this next to my bed. <laughs> Max, you don't have to lie. You can tell her you hate it. I mean, what kind of a mother spends five dollars on their son's Christmas present? Hmm. Honey, um, would you mind giving us a moment? You know, I don't think you understand what the holidays are about. You see, I may not be able to afford fancy cookies from an award-winning chef, but my son and I put a lot of love into the cookies we made, and that is what matters. And I may not be able to buy expensive things for the White Elephant Exchange, but I put a lot of time into decorating that ornament with my son. And to me, that means a lot more. And I may not be able to afford a lot of Christmas presents for my son, but I teach him to be grateful for everything that he gets, no matter the cost. And that matters more than anything. So you see, the holidays are not about how much you spend. They are about how much love you give. Sounds like something a poor person would say. You clearly have no idea what the holidays are about. These cookies are so good. They're my favorite. Yeah, are there any more? <laughs> I'm so glad that you like them. I tell you what, I can make more and send them to you. Um, <laughs> did you try the ones that I bought over there? Those are gross. Yeah, no one's eating those. I want more of these. Excuse me, Karen. Do you still have that handmade ornament by chance? Yes. Why? Is it possible to trade you, actually? That one reminds me of my childhood. My mom used to make ones just like that for our tree. Really? You would rather have some cheap, handmade ornament than a crystal one? Ugh. Whatever. Here. Thanks so much. I can't believe this. What's wrong, sweetheart? You didn't give me the new PS5. Well, I figured since you had the PS4, you didn't need the 5. You've got all those other great gifts. I don't care about all the other stupid gifts. I wanted a PS5. I'm sorry, honey. I will get you one as soon as I can. This is seriously the worst Christmas ever. I hate you. Here's some advice. It's not about 
how much money you spend. It's about how much love that you give. It was nice to see you, Karen. Thanks again, Mom. I love you so much. <laughs> Okay, honey, we have one last present for you. Bet you're never gonna guess what it is. Oh, yes! I knew you guys wouldn't forget. Of course we wouldn't. <laughs> oh, my buddy. A book? You caught me a dumb book? It's not a dumb book. Just open it up. I think you'll like it. Like it? I hate it. I asked for an iPad, not some stupid book. Evan, just open the book, please. No, I asked for an iPad. This isn't fair. I don't want this dumb book. Evan. You don't understand. Now I'll be the only kid in school without an iPad. This is the worst Christmas ever. Honey, there are a lot of kids out there who don't get anything for Christmas. Yeah, but that's their problem, not mine. Okay. I'm going across the street to Brad's house. I bet his parents bought him an iPad. This is the worst Christmas ever. What were they even thinking? Merry Christmas, sweetie. Merry Christmas, Mom. Guess what? I've got a surprise for you. No way! A Christmas gift? <laughs> but I thought you said that we couldn't afford one this year. I know, but I've been saving up because you have been so good. And I just wanted to do something special. Are you sure, Mom? <laughs> yes, baby. <laughs> yes. Go ahead, open it. <laughs> A book? You got me a book? I know. It's not much. I wish I could have got you something better. Mom, are you kidding? There are kids out there who don't even have Christmas gifts. I love it. Thank you so much. You are so welcome, sweetie. I love you. I love you too, Mom. This is the best Christmas ever. Evan, we've been waiting for you. I'm glad you're home, buddy. Look, I, I'm really sorry about what I said earlier. But, um, actually, I really love this book. And it's the best present ever. Oh. I'm glad you like it. Okay, now open the book. What? Money? Is this for me? Yes! Yes, you see, the money for your iPad was in the book the whole time. All you had to do was open it. Oh my gosh! I can't believe this! Thank you guys so much! You guys are the best! Actually... Do I have to buy the iPad with this money? Well, no. I suppose not, but... Isn't that what you wanted the most? You know, I think there's something better I can do with it. Come with me. Excuse me. Here, this is for you and your son. Oh, but it's so much money. Uh... Are you sure? Yes, I'm sure. Happy holidays. Thank you. God bless you. You sweet, sweet boy. Thank you so much. God bless you too. Oh, this is 
the top I've been wanting. Thank you, Mom. <laughs> You're welcome, hon. Happy birthday. And, sweetie, got one last little gift for you. Dad, you shouldn't have. <laughs> oh my God, Dad, is this what I think it is? You know how bad I've been wanting them. I don't know, you're just gonna have to open it up and see. Oh, I knew it, I knew you guys wouldn't forget. I can't wait to post this on my Insta. A Honda? Happy birthday, sweetheart. You guys got me a crappy Honda? What, what, what do you mean? I thought that that's what you wanted, a car for your birthday. Yeah, I wanted a car. Not a cheap Honda. I thought you were gonna get me a BMW like you have. I can't be seen driving to school in an ugly Honda. Jenna, that's not nice. You know, there's a lot of kids that have to take the bus to school because they don't have a car at all. You should be grateful for what you have. Well, how is that my problem? This is seriously the worst birthday ever. Jenna. You know what? Forget it. Thanks for nothing. Where are you going? I'll be at Brittany's. At least she has a nice car. Well, that didn't go how I imagined it. I can't believe they didn't get me a BMW. I'm gonna be caught dead in a haunted. Happy birthday, dear Christo. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, Christo. Thank you, Dad. <laughs> I got you a little something for your birthday. It's not much. But I've been saving up for a little while. Present? But Dad, this should have gone to food. I didn't need anything. <sighs> Don't worry. You deserve this. So go on. Open it. A bus pass? I know. I'm sorry that I couldn't get you anything more. I just felt bad that you had to walk to school every day. What's wrong? You don't like it? I love it, actually. I'm just so happy that I don't have to walk to school anymore. I'm grateful for everything I have. Thank you, Dad. Anything for you, sweetheart. And one day I'll be able to buy you a car for your birth. I promise. Dad, are you kidding? I don't need a car. I can take the bus now. <laughs> I'm just happy I don't have to walk to school anymore. I love you so much. I love you too, Dad. <laughs> Jenna, you're back. I thought you were going to Brittany's. Actually, I changed my mind. Look, Mom and I talked about it, and, uh, here you go. What's this? Key to the BMW? Yeah. I just, I felt bad about you having to drive that Honda around, so it's okay. You take my car and I'll drive the Honda instead. What's wrong? Aren't you excited? Isn't this what you wanted? Yeah, Jenna, aren't you happy? Actually, it's okay, Dad. I don't need it. But... I'm sorry, Dad. For everything. I'm happy with the Honda. Why the change of heart? Well, I just learned to be grateful for what I have. You and Mom forgive me. Jen, we're so proud of you. Of course we forgive you. Hope you guys clean up. <laughs> Oh my gosh, can we get this one, Dad? It is perfect. I don't know, $300?
That's really expensive. Hey, what about this one? It's pretty nice. What? No, it's, it's so small. I want a big one like we got last year. I know, Robbie. But things have been harder for us this year. You know that. And besides, a lot of kids don't even have a tree at all. And you're really lucky to even be getting one. Lucky? Yeah, right. This is the worst Christmas tree ever. I can't believe you're getting this. Oh, here are the lights. I like these. Uh, well, hold, hold on a minute. Those are $40. We can't spend $40 on lights. How about these ones? They're only $10. Let's get these. But those, they, they look so action. cheap. I like these, I don't want those. I know, Robbie. But it's been a hard year and money is tight. You're just gonna have to make these work. Oh, you can't be serious. You won't let me get anything I want. Robbie, do you know how many people don't have lights at all? You should be grateful. Oh, stop saying that. I told you, what other people don't have isn't my problem. Let's just go get my iPhone. Okay, so the two versions that we have left are the iPhone 12 mini and the Pro Max. Which one would you like? I'll take the Pro Max. Um, uh, what's the difference in price? The Pro Max is 1100 and the Mini starts at 700. They're both great phones, to be honest. It's a big price difference. Why don't you take the Mini instead? What? No way! I'm sorry, but the Mini is a lot cheaper. And it's still a brand new phone. We'll take the Mini. No, no, I want the Pro Max. I don't want the Mini. Robbie, there are a lot of people out there that don't get anything for Christmas. You should be grateful for this. I don't care about other people. First, you get us a crappy tree, then you get us some cheap lights, and now you're gonna get me the wrong iPhone for my present? Thank you for ruining Christmas. You are the worst dad ever. Hey, wait. Where are you going? I'm going outside. Gosh, I don't want to be here anymore. <sighs> the mini? I mean, what was he thinking? Oh, yeah, yeah, can I look now? Okay, hold on. Uh, hold on, son. <sighs> okay, you can look. Is that a Christmas tree? Yeah, I, I found it in the trash. I know it's not like the real trees we used to have. I'm sorry, I, I just feel terrible that I can't even get you a real tree or Christmas lights for that matter. Dad, stop it. This is perfect. I love it so much. Besides, there's some people out there that don't have a Christmas tree at all. Oh, I almost forgot. I got you a present. I know it's not much, but I know how bad you really wanted this. So I've been saving up for it. An old iPhone? I'm sorry. I know it's old and the screen's cracked. I understand if you don't like it. Are you serious? I don't like it. I love it. <laughs> There's some kids out there that don't get any Christmas presents at all, you know? Dad, why are you crying? I just feel like the worst dad in the world. I wish we didn't have to spend Christmas on the streets. <laughs> Please, don't say that. I'm just happy that I get to spend it with you. I'm so grateful for everything. Merry Christmas, son. I love you so much. Love you too, Dad. Merry Christmas.
Robbie. I've been so worried about you. I'm I'm so sorry, Dad. I I, I shouldn't have ran out like that. And, and and wait, you got the big Christmas tree? Yeah, I know how bad you wanted it. I also got the lights you wanted. Wait, what? Really? I even got you the iPhone 12 Pro Max. <gasps> Merry Christmas. Thank you, thank you so much. I can't believe it. Wait, how did you afford all this? I thought that, you know, money was tight. Well, I didn't have enough money. I opened up a brand new store credit card to buy it for you. You did that for me? Wow. Uh, thank you so much, Dad, but actually, uh, I don't want it. Because I am perfectly happy with the Mini. And with the cheaper lights, and with the smaller tree. What are you talking about? I know that you wanted all these things. I did. But I learned a very important lesson today and I realize that I should be grateful for all the things that I have. You were right. I really am the luckiest kid in the world because I, uh, I have a dad like you. I love you, Dad. Wow. I was not expecting that. I love you too, son. <laughs> well, what am I gonna do with all these things that I bought? <laughs> we can exchange them, uh, because I'm more than happy with the things that we had before. I am so excited to set up our new Christmas tree. Me too. Uh, actually, Dad, do you mind if I invite two people over to spend Christmas with us? Um, sure, but, but who? Excuse me. Yes. Can I help you? My dad and I, uh, we wanted to know if you'd like to spend Christmas with us. Wow. Thank you so much, but that would be too much. Please. No one deserves to spend Christmas on the streets. We would love to have the two of you over. Well, what do you think? It's up to you, Dad. I'm happy with whatever. Okay, <laughs> let's go. We really appreciate this. Thank you so much. You're welcome. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. Okay, let's go. We have dinner waiting at home. <laughs> Los Angeles High School is now- Cut! Don't let him get to you. Yeah, Mom. You are fired. I'm going to make it on camera. You can start a YouTube channel. <laughs> the girl who cannot speak English is gonna make we it on camera. We can make all these videos by ourselves. What a joke. All you have to do is be yourself.